Team of the season is finally here, and I can guarantee that your sub box right now is probably very, very blue. Lots of people releasing team of the season related videos, which is great. There's loads of hype behind it, but maybe there's some of you out there that don't have the coins to buy the TOTS players, or you're looking for something which can destroy TOTS teams. That was my intention for the random pick today. I figured what we needed to do was choose the most overpowered looking player for our three selections. So we get a Daniel Star. As our first player on page number five, we've set five to 15k margins for gold players, and I basically just wanted to choose the one which I thought looked the most overpowered for each of my selections. We get page number 10, we get Ramirez. I mean, that is a 100% definite going into the squad. He is ridiculous this year. And then, well, if it doesn't get any better than that, well, it does. Because we get 84 rated um, Pierre, Emmerich, or Bomiang. That is upgraded or Bomiang. He's OP as anything with that 96 pace. Um, so those are our three players. And uh, hopefully we can put them into a team that we can dub the Tots Destroyers. Or some sort of overpowered team that you guys could build for, I don't know, around 50,000 coins that would destroy people using TOTS players. That's the idea. This is where each of the three players are going to play. And the full squad around them looks a little bit like this in this 4-4-1-1 formation. Um, we've got Casilla in goal, a Spanish goalie plays for Real Madrid. Uh, and then at the left back and right back spots, we've got Tremolina, someone I've used time and time again, very overpowered. And then Mykon, whose stats are ridiculous across the board. Centre-backs today, we've got Leandro Castan, uh, and we've also got Varane, who is, again, one of the more overpowered players on the game. Loads of pace, great defending, six foot three as well. Now, in the midfield, we have got a uh, one non-rare, unfortunately. It's Emre Chan, who's a very good, cheap uh, BPL player. we then got Douglas Costa and Marco Royce, two of the more expensive players in this team. But they will <laughs> they will perform absolutely incredibly for you. Um, our first random pick player is Ramirez. He's 80 rated. He's got 88 pace as a CDM default. We're playing him as a center mid today. Um, and he is just crazy, crazy high working and, uh, well, very, very quick. Next up, we've got Daniel Sturridge as our second round of pick player. He's going to play the centre forward role in this formation and he's got 89 pace, 81 dribbling and 83 shooting. Not too shabby. Very, very classy. Overpowered, sort of very difficult to defend against striker. And then Aubameyang. He's pretty much known as the king of sweat. 96 pace, 84 rated uh, with 83 shooting and 80 dribbling. That is our team. We've got lots of pace. I reckon the average pace in this team is ridiculous. Over 80, I reckon. Way over 80, I reckon. Um, and it's just... it's. It's one of those teams where um, you can build it and it was like 60,000 coins. You haven't got any special items in there. You've got a couple of upgrades, a couple of very quick players, a couple of skillful players. But all in honesty, it's like a team which will come together. Uh, everyone will get involved. As you can see here, I'm not just scoring with the likes of Aubameyang and Sturridge. In fact... I scored more with both Royce and Douglas Costa than I did. Oh, look at this from Douglas Costa, by the way. He picks it up. The goalkeeper's still off his line. And that right there in an absolute stunning goal. I was well pleased with that one when that went in. Because I thought, you know what? I've got to go for the chip. The keeper's still off his line. Um, and then this, I mean, this for me is about as skillful as a skill goal gets. Like... I've done a couple of five-star skills. There's another five-star skill. There's another five-star skill inside the box. In off the post, I think. Or it definitely hits the side net in. What a goal that was from Douglas Costa. His upgraded version is very good. Gets me excited for a team of the season, Douglas Costa. Um, and then we've got goals. Well, I've classed that as like a Ramirez goal because it comes off of... Both the defenders. So the last player of my team to touch it was Ramirez. But this is a Ramirez goal. He gets inside the box. Shoots across the keeper. In off the post. That was a lovely finish for someone who's not known for his shooting on this game. Um, and he does get into areas like that. Like for a, for a defensive kind of midfielder. He is always in the box. Like ready to score a goal. Which I think gives him extra points. But it also probably takes a few points off of him. For being out of position some of the time. Um, but Marco Royce turned into like an absolute goal. He is the most expensive player in this team. He's around half the cost of the entire squad. Under 30k. Um, 
But very, very worth it. Like 27k or something. Probably dropping even further with Tots being out now. Um, but it's just a crazy team. Like, he's a free kick taker. That means you've got your set piece taker in the squad. You've got loads of pace across the board. I mean, Sturridge and Aubameyang, as much as I like them both, and they both performed pretty well, they didn't really get that involved by getting goals on the score sheet. Um, that was the one goal we scored with Sturridge right there. For the rest of the time, he almost sat back a little bit. And Ramirez ran past him for, for a starters, which I'm not too happy about um but like it was Douglas uh, sorry Daniel Sturridge would play the ball out to Marco Royce and out to Douglas Costa and then we would get the goals that way which is fine by me um Aubameyang got a couple of goals on the score sheet but for, as for out and out strikers I don't think they perform perfectly for me um whereas I've used them before and they've done a lot better job so I know that it's there and that you guys that are better at FIFA than I am will definitely be able to get the most out of a team like this it's just got pace absolutely everywhere and solid players there so it's one of those sweaty teams that you just do not want to come up against so rather than coming up against it why don't you build it and uh, play people with it um I actually came up a guy against a guy with Pele and Ronaldo and Neymar and he quit within two minutes I didn't even have a shot he just obviously didn't like the look of me team and he quit um but in terms of everyone rating them in this uh, the favorite two players were definitely Royce and Douglas Costa they both got three goals between them in like four or five games which I think was really good from left mid and right mid uh Emre Chan solid job a little bit out of position he seemed to drift wide sometimes which is a bit weird and then Ramirez like he's a great player I really really like him and in terms of rating gets five star and a nine out of ten the only reason he's not perfect for the role is because he does drift forward a little bit too much and then of course if someone's going to be my perfect midfielder they maybe need to have like four star skill moves um daniel Sturridge gets four and a half star value for money he's really cheap now he's definitely not the cost that i've paid that right there i've had him since the start of the game um but a 7.5 out of 10 is a distinctly average rating i would expect the center forward to get more goals uh, and then again sort of same with obomiang like he's very good he was better than Sturridge. um four and a half star value for money he's i think he's now under 10k which is great um and an eight out of 10 which is an above average rating but not the best you've seen on the the random pick this year so that's the random pick for today i hope you've enjoyed it it's basically been not a top squad but something that you guys can use to to beat tots squads or if you've not got many coins and all you're seeing is tots videos in your sub box then here's a different alternative for you guys i hope you've enjoyed if you have make sure you smash a like on the video and of course subscribe to my channel if you are new thanks so much for watching have a great sunday and i'll catch you next time guys peace